And no matter what you do, you know God Still. loves yes. Lord, help me again. Oh, yes. and, 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 and see, and so if I know he loves me wherever he takes me, that's where I'm going to go. Things present, no things to come. 
say nothing in his creation, and no one in his creation shall be able to separate you. And he also said tribulation or distresses, persecution, famine, peril, sword, nothing can separate me from the love of Christ. Do you understand what he's telling you? No matter what you do or what they do, you can never be separated from God's love. It is just too great. Just shout out your name and say, receive it, please. Receive it, please. All right, there's somebody here this night. Just receive it. Just, just don't try to figure it out. Don't try to qualify for it. One of the biggest mistakes of the church is we have taught you to qualify for God. Amen. You're under another covenant, general love. You don't live under the law. You have a new covenant. Everything about your covenant is faith. You say it by faith, receive inheritance by faith, receive love by faith. You, everything you do, you do by faith. If you're with me, say amen. amen. So let me leave this with you right now. I want you to really get this place in your life, practice it right now, where you make a decision, I'm going to receive, I need to tell somebody something. The reason why you continue to put up with it is because you have not received love for yourself. When you know that you're worthy, when you receive that you're worthy of the love of God, then you are not, you're not going to be willing to tolerate anybody not loving you. Get the packet! 